Hi everyone, it's Wendy. Um, unfortunate sidekick. Unfortunate? Why are you unfortunate? So this is a quick one, Wallstock Park on the beautiful uh, west side. Wallstock means the beautiful river, apparently, according to the sign. Uh, named after the Wallstock First Nations. And this is uh, west side, but kind of uh, where everything converges, uh, very close to where we live. So we come here often, and a lot of people do. And I'm just going to go off to the right here and show uh, where a lot of people just come with a cup of coffee and look at the beautiful views of Uptown. Oh, I would if this guy would cooperate. <laughs> So we're looking down on the St. John River, where it meets the harbor. And you can see beautiful uptown St. John from here. Mm -hmm. uh, my favorite harbor bridge it connects the east side to everything else. And this is just a wonderful park with picnic tables, uh, benches, lots of grassy area, trees. You can access reversing falls from here on foot. The first year we were here, we actually brought some uh, deck chairs and we lined it up along this ridge here and we watched the fireworks coming from uptown. It was amazing. It was uh, pretty spectacular to see such a show from a distance and we didn't have to be in the heart of uptown. So. Yeah, that was great. Canada, that's great. This is uh, the access road here. It's a one-way road, so it just goes around the whole park. Uh, there's beautiful statues in here. So the statues are of the... Uh, the Elders, um, I guess? Yeah, the indigenous elders. Leaders? Leaders, maybe. I'm sorry we're not experts on indigenous culture, but uh, we do appreciate the history that goes with them. Yes. We believe there is actually a plan to uh, change the name of the St. John River to reflect the uh, all of stock history. Yeah, that would be great. But uh, yeah, just a beautiful, peaceful park. We've had picnics here with family members that came to visit. Yes, look at that. Oh my gosh. <gasps> See that bench down there, just a phenomenal Gorgeous. view of the reversing falls. Pretty amazing. This is the bench which is covered here that we had a picnic on. We did, yes, with your brother and his wife. Look at that, look at that view. Of the I know, right? Right we had the best seat in the house. It was amazing. And as with everything else, this uh, part here, you can see a bit of the pulp mill, so you can get the industry with the beauty in St. John. But uh, phenomenal uh, grassy areas here. Yes. So much greenery in this city. And this again is another park just smack dab in the middle of the city. It's lovely. It's a lovely green space. So a little tidbit about this. This area here used to be the home of a huge um, huge hospital and was it for it was a um, psychiatric, psychiatric hospital that's right. And uh, it was back in the day where, uh, you know, they didn't care for those who had a few issues and they didn't know how to handle them, so they locked them up. And there was a few people that had uh, died in the hospital here. And apparently, this park here is the most haunted area in all of St. John. Little tidbit for you. Lots of ghosts around here. I wouldn't come here at night. <laughs> Well, she means because of the ghosts. That's right. <laughs> it's a very, very safe place it to is. be. It is, yes, because of the ghosts. Les doesn't believe in ghosts, so he always like gives me the big eye roll whenever I talk ghost stories, but whatever. Anyway, it's a beautiful park. We just wanted to show it to you. We, uh, we always talk highly of the west side, and there just seems to be never-ending places to, to visit and appreciate for their natural beauty here yes. on the west side of St. John. So, we're coming close to the end, but again, you see the mature trees and the shade cover. So lovely. 
statues throughout and it's just amazing all right guys so another beautiful park in beautiful st john uh nice balmy day and i hope you all uh enjoy our videos please subscribe if you haven't already um and uh yeah we'll see you next video we love st john